China is once again proving it's not slowing down in the tech race. Their humanoid robots have already mastered kung fu moves. Affordable robots for enthusiasts have hit the market. And there are even underwater robots now. Recently, I stumbled across an awesome video from the Chinese government that's gone viral online as a warm-up for their 2025 government work report. In this video, you'll discover Chinese humanoid robots, speedy robot dogs, industrial robots, and even lunar rovers, all showcasing China's robotic prowess. From flips to martial arts, it's a technological revolution that'll blow your mind. Let's get started. First up, the stars of the show, humanoid robots stealing the spotlight in the video. Picture this, Engine AI's PM01 nails the world's first front flip by a humanoid in February 2025. It's 1.38 meters tall, 40 kilos, built to last 5 to 10 years, and costs about $12,000 with the first batch of deliveries starting in the second quarter of this year. It is designed for scientific research and education scenarios, primarily for algorithm validation and secondary development. And next, meet the Engine AI SE1, a full-size humanoid dropping jaws with its slick moves. At 1.65 meters tall and 48 kilos, it's rocking aerospace-grade aluminum and 32 degrees of freedom for smooth, dynamic struts, clocking in at 2 meters per second. That's faster than your average jog. Powered by NVIDIA and Intel chips, with three high-def stereo cameras, it's scanning the world like a pro. Battery's good for two hours and it's got a quick swap system. Boom! Back in action! Built for research, factories, and maybe even your next barista gig, it's priced around $21,000 to $28,000, making it a steal compared to Tesla's Optimus. The secret sauce? A neural network mixing reinforcement and imitation learning, plus custom joints that flex like a gymnast. Then there's Xiaoxing Max from Beijing's robot era. It climbed the Great Wall last year. At 1.65 meters, it's got dexterous hands for factory or service gigs. Their Star 1 model teams up with a massive robotics foundation model called ERA42, already snapped up by companies for research, manufacturing, and more. Meet one of China's most famous robots, the G1 from Hangzhou's Unitree Robotics. At 1.3 meters tall and 35 kilos, this compact marvel can pull off up to 43 independent moves. Think punches, spins, smooth dance routines, and kung fu tricks, all on a two-hour battery. Starting at $16,000, it's equipped with force position hybrid control, making it sensitive, reliable, and precise enough to mimic human hands for delicate tasks. Then there's its bigger sibling, the H1, a full-sized humanoid standing nearly 180 centimeters and weighing around 47 kilograms. Unitree kicked off mass production of the H1 series in October 2023, with each unit priced around $90,000. Built for top-tier performance, it hits speeds of 3.3 meters per second, packs a punch with up to 360 newton meters of torque, and handles tough tasks thanks to its sturdy build and advanced navigation skills. Naturally, those powerful motors, larger frame, and cutting-edge tech drive up the cost. And Booster Robotics Booster T1, from a Xinhua team since 2023, 1.2 meters, 30 kilos, does push-ups, Yip Man squats, and plays soccer like a champ. Lightweight, durable, and ready for classrooms or labs. But it's not just humanoids. Quadruped robots, those four-legged biomimetic beasts, are strutting their stuff too. At the Hangzhou Asian Games, they hauled discuses, proving they're perfect for transport, reconnaissance, military scouting, search and rescue, environmental monitoring, and even farming inspections. Unitree Robotics Wheeled Robot Dog teamed up with Zhejiang University's Black Panther 2.0. 38 kilos, hitting 10 meters per second, the fastest quadruped globally. Launched this year from their SciTech Center, these bots mimic animal moves and get the job done where wheels won't cut it. Then there's the industrial heavyweights. Shanghai Fanuks got 260 models, 
loads from 500 grams to 2.3 tons. Handling assembly, welding, casting, painting, and palletizing across production lines. Shanghai Electric dropped 3 billion yuan in October 2024 to snag a chunk of Shanghai Fanuc Robotics through their automation group, Big Money for Big Robots. Speaking of heavy hitters, eFort's another name making waves in China's industrial scene. Their articulated robots are built tough and versatile, powering up factories across the country with some next-level automation. eFort's bots aren't just about checking boxes. They're engineered to handle the gritty, real-world demands of modern manufacturing. Picture them in action. Arc welding car frames with pinpoint accuracy, spot welding under tight deadlines, or grinding down metal edges until they're flawless. They're loading heavy parts onto assembly lines, polishing surfaces to a mirror finish, and even painting with a steady hand that never tires. These robots thrive in high-stakes industries like automotive and new energy, where efficiency is king, but they're just as comfortable in the fast-paced world of 3C electronics. Think phones, computers, and gadgets. eFort's strength lies in its knack for blending raw power with smart tech, like sensors and AI-driven controls, to keep production humming smoothly. They're not flashy, but they're the reliable backbone, keeping China's factories competitive on the global stage. Next, the sky and beyond. DJI's T-100 agricultural drone, out since November 2024, weighs in with a 150 kilo takeoff limit, 75 kilos of spraying payload, and 150 liters for spreading. It's spraying pesticides, tossing fertilizer, and lifting loads, with AI dodging obstacles and AR boosting precision. Laser weeding robots? They're mowing down overseas markets, spotted at CES 2025, zapping weeds for courtyard owners. Underwater robots are rewriting the rules of ocean exploration, and China's leading the charge with some seriously cool tech. These machines dive deep, way deeper than any human could, snagging critical data for oceanography, geology, and biology. But it's not just about science. These bots are clutch for search and rescue missions, underwater maintenance, and even keeping divers out of dangerous spots. And one standout in this underwater revolution is the Fifish Ego from Quizia, a Chinese company that's making waves, pun intended. The Fifish Ego isn't your average drone. It's a next-gen underwater beast built for pros. Picture this, a sleek, hammerhead, shark-inspired design that cuts through currents like a hot knife through butter. It's modular, meaning you can swap out parts like the motor, camera, or battery in minutes. Perfect for long missions where downtime's not an option. This thing rocks a 4K camera with a crazy 176-degree ultra-wide lens, capturing every detail from coral reefs to shipwrecks in stunning clarity. Plus, it's got 10,000 lumens of LED light. Imagine lighting up the pitch-black ocean depths like it's daytime. It can hit speeds over three knots and dive up to 200 meters, all while hauling tools like robotic arms or water samplers, up to six at once. Whether it's inspecting offshore rigs, filming marine life, or recovering lost gear, the ego's got the muscle and smarts for the job. What sets it apart? AI. This drone's packed with intelligent features, like locking onto targets with a single click or filtering out murky plankton for crystal clear shots. It's even got hot swappable batteries, so you can keep it running without a reboot. Charge 1 to 90% in just 50 minutes while the other's in action. QYSEA launched this bad boy as part of their push to dominate underwater robotics, and it's already turning heads globally. From ocean science to energy exploration, the Fish Ego is proof China's not just playing the game, they're rewriting it. And the grand finale, a lunar rover. China's manned lunar program says astronauts will hit the moon before 2030, with two driving this bad boy for science. It's got manned controls, lunar mobility, positioning, and safety features. Think communication and exploration support on wheels. From Earth to the moon, China's robots are reaching new frontiers. So, what's driving this robot madness? 
It's China's tech network running at peak power, something I talked about this in detail in one of my previous videos. Where industries join forces and lift each other up, growing together seamlessly, co-evolution style. Robot Era, Unitree, Shanghai Fanuc, DJI, they're not just building bots, they're shaping the future. The robot video presented by Chinese government isn't just a flex. It's a preview of robots as China's new productive force, from factories to farms to the freaking moon. From kung fu kicking humanoids to lunar rovers, China's robot revolution is unreal. What robot do you like best? Drop it in the comments below, hit that like button if you enjoyed the video and subscribe to the channel. Because next up, I'm diving deep into Unitree Robotics, a Chinese crew that went from a dorm room to the Super Bowl. Trust me, you won't want to miss it. See you soon.